Hey guys, Big Renny Zilzo Zero here. We're gonna review one of the um, uh, low riders, and my friend FTube18 is gonna review it for us because he knows about this update. So, a um, couple months ago, uh, GTA 5 came out the low riders update with like you can get like subs in your car, you can get low riders, there's new clothing, a couple of other new things too. So, we're gonna go ahead and go in uh, first person and uh, get started. Alright, so um, this is the Willard fa Wait, actually, I'll just be. This is the Willard faction. It is um, it has a V8 in, as in, in it, as you can tell. It is very loud and very mean. But um, right now we're gonna do this, which is actually really cool. You can I can um, turn the car on while I'm not inside of it, and I can turn the headlights on. Wait, is that only for lowriders? Yeah, I can turn the neon lights on. This is you can do this on any car now, I think. But um I can what this is the coolest part. Um I can do this. Which Bro. All right, and then wait. Is How it do cool I get my play? flashlight? Um here, I'll just do it. Why is it always night in this game? Honestly, I don't even know. But there's um a bunch of like hydraulics in the and like speakers in there and the interior is really nice I like I um, customize everything like red and... okay yeah I'll go in first person once we drive this thing yeah and then look at the engine you can customize what the engine looks like and everything and I made it all chrome with like it looks uh, sweet vents. and then all right this is honestly like in my um, opinion this is like my like my favorite part but um here I'm gonna put on West Coast Classics, but because there is um, speakers in my trunk, I can play music out of it, and it's extremely loud. Like you can hear it, and um. Yeah, I can hear it far away, unlike other cars. We yeah. need to drive it then. Can we drive it with everything open? Um, no, everything would probably fall off. Oh, that's a pretty nice interior. Yeah. Here, I'm gonna try and I can't find the button to like turn I mean close everything you can turn the radio off if you want there so we go. and then this is also the best part is you can like <laughs> oh my god it looks have, so like, bad for first person insane hydraulics here oh I don't even know if you noticed the rims but they're like they're like custom rims and they're like insanely cool Oh my god. Wait. That's insane. You can like tip the car by doing this. <laughs> can you actually do it? Or is that really hard to? Here, I'll wait. You have to like... It's pretty hard to do. I almost did it. My front bumper is like wiggling. Here, wait. I'm gonna see how I can go doing this <laughs> holy crap look at for first person so basically you control the hydraulics by holding down X and then hitting wow fuck you um, <laughs> you, can, you control the hydraulics by holding down X and then um, here when you hit X your car does this it raises but if you um, then hit X again it lowers this guy might shoot us. Shit, that'd be annoying. Um, but if you hold down X and, like, for example, A, it does this. But if you hold down X and then D, it does this. And then shift, it, like, I think it he wants like to race. And then control does this. And then a lot of people make the mistake of, like, they'll be playing with their hydraulics and they'll forget to, like, put it back. And they'll be, like, driving around on their side they probably think their tires popped <laughs> yeah like um I've literally watched a video of these I'm oh, sorry I watched a video where someone was driving around like this complaining that um, hydraulics broke their suspension <laughs> and oh crap they were like, dude, dude it's, it was so low that like you smashed into a like a yeah. curb no, it's only low on one side and that like I watched a video where someone was like dude it breaks your suspension look 
and he was driving around like this. But like, all you need to do is once you hit X, it like, it does this. It just like clears out. You can like jump while you're driving by holding down X. It's funny. So how many more uh, vehicles are there like this? There is six um, cars that you can customize. With this like same kind of configuration. Like um yeah, six, there are six cars that you can turn into lowriders. There's the Willard Faction, the Declasse Moonbeam, the um the Vapid Voodoo. Um, I, I'm th I'm just doing this by memory. So if this, if I didn't get any of these wrong, how much like, does it cost to get lowriders? Um, the cars are like pretty cheap. Pretty cheap, but to upgrade them, it costs around a million dollars. Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. This car. No way. Um, this car is like twenty six thousand dollars, and then once you get in the shop, if you want to add hydraulics, it's around two hundred grand, and then like. Armor is like around 50 grand and then um, Your hydraulic upgrade is around like 200 grand again, and then you can fixing your upgrading what your engine looks like is extremely expensive too Like mm -hmm. around a hundred thousand dollars Per like there's a bunch of different customization options and then your interior there's so much into I feel like you can customize your interior more than your exterior which is awesome I think because like you've never been able to do that in Grand Theft Auto, which is like revolutionary. Oh yeah, I also noticed you have a bobble head or bobble head. Yeah, bobble it, head. I have a bobble head um right there, and then my rear column shifter is a skull with a cigarette in it, and then um I made the interior red, and I made the I don't know if you noticed, but the um the gauges have like wings on them, like on in the inside of them. That's sweet. Do you mind if I test drive it for real quick? Alright. Let's do this. I don't know how to control the hydraulics or anything. Alright, just hold down. Just hit X and then A and D and like, um, control and shift. Dude, that's so cool. Yeah. The controls are actually kind of simple. It's even easier on the Xbox controllers. I'm like bottoming him out right now. That's so cool. Let's drive this around. You can do that while you're driving it too. That's cool. The engine is so loud. That's one thing I like about this car is it has like a V8 in it. Like in the in like when you're inside, it sounds amazing. Like in first person, I mean. Oh crap! Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's sweet. I don't know how to control the hydraulics very well. I have to get used to it. That's sweet. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I'll end a review of the lowrider. Uh, whatever car that was, I forgot again. But uh, uh, I noticed. The I noticed at the airport all these uh, things are different colors. That's cool. Anyways, I think that'll be all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed that review, and I'll see you guys later. Sorry if it went a little long, but um, don't forget to subscribe, like, leave some comments, and let me know what you guys think about the update. Get out of here, Cameron.